Hey, Kenny, how's it going, man? It's Dave on with for Boats for Less. Just talked to you on the phone. I'm going to go ahead and shoot this uh, video for you of the 180 Fisherman. It's the Wellcraft 18-footer. I'll go around the whole boat. I'll get the trailer, the engine, the inside of the boat, so you can see exactly what you're, um, what you're looking at there in the pictures. So let me start up here on the front, and we'll go around the whole boat, man. Okay, Kenny, here's the trailer. Winch is in good shape, has a little uh, safety chain there as well. Okay, it's an aluminum trailer, easy loader. Bunks are in good shape. Um, tires are decent, has plastic fenders, which are good. They never rust out or anything. Um, and guide posts over there. Um, we'll go to the front of the boat. This is the underneath on the hull. There's no damage whatsoever. Boat's in good shape. Let's we'll start off at the bow here. Get a view of the port side. Okay, let's go around the back. Here's the motor, which is a Yamaha four cylinder, 115 horsepower. And like I told you on the phone, the motor's in really good shape. And stainless steel propeller. There's your lower unit. It's in very good condition. There's your trim pump. No corrosion on anything. No rust on any of the bolts. Um, the steering arm there on the motor is in great condition. Okay, this is the uh, back of the boat. You got a uh, boarding ladder right here um, with a handle. Very easy to get in the boat. And now that we're in here, there's the live well, which is stationed right between, right behind the uh, two captain's chairs. Um, go up to the dash. There's your gauges, all your controls and switches. There's the helm, stereo, um, it has a Hummingbird fish finder, Hummingbird 141. Little glove compartment there, two cup holders, and the compass. If we move along to the front, or the bow, it's got a lot of nice storage. Okay. Anchor locker up up at the bow. Two bow cleats. There's your bow light. I'm turning around. You got storage in here. This is the seat in front of the center console. And it's also it drains, which is a good good feature. If you ever get any water in there, um, it's self bailing. We'll go around this side. Yeah, here on this side of the boat um, is the cushion. This side has the backrest. The starboard side does not. Now you can either buy another one for that side, or if it was me, I would just get rid of this one, which I can do for you. Um, there's also storage underneath both of those seats. You have some rod holders here, as well as on the gunnels. Okay. Your stern light, um, an outlet for the uh, salt water wash down. The deck in this boat is also self bailing. It has um, large scuppers right here in the back, which is very good. If you ever get any water in the boat, um, it will exit right out on its own. Um, no bilge pump needed. Okay, I'm going to hop down and we'll get the starboard side of the boat. This right here, here's fuel fill. Bear with me here, it's a little cramped. I have a lot of boats here. And here's another shot of the bow and the bimini top.
All right, Kenny, so I'll get this uh, video up on YouTube. I'll send you the link. Take a look at it and give me a call back, buddy. Thank you.